On June 30th, we hired Caravelle to come down and apply extract with the corn and hay fields for wood crust as a replacement for synthetic fertilizer. This is the first time we have done a big application on large acreage. So to go over the extractor made by Hiawassee Products, this is the first prototype. You put the compost in the hopper and then it flows through the stainless steel cover. Inside the cover is a screen. If you can see, there's an auger inside a screen. And then inside the auger, we pump in water, which comes out of flood jet tips. And the water is pointed back at the flowing compost, which is rinsing the compost and extracting the biology and put it into a liquid form. Then the waste compost comes out at the end, falls into a bucket, and can be recycled back into a compost compost pile or back into potting soil. The finished liquid product goes through a sand trap where the heavier particles settle out so they don't get clogged in the pump and then they get cycled into storage tanks or into the sprayer. Then I have a mixing tank here that I add in all the foods. So I first fill it up with extract and then I add in all the different foods that I'm adding into a spray. It basically give the organisms a lunch pail as they go out to the field to increase their ability to transfer into the new location. It then mixes around creating a vortex in that tank and then once I have mixed it enough I then pump it into the storage tank. So that recipe was for 300 gallons and then I batch it out in 300 gallons. So then to fill up the sprayer, the sprayer is 1,600 gallon tank, and so each IBC bin holds about 275 gallons, and then I have a 1,000 gallon trailer tank as well, so I had about 2,000 gallons of storage here, and this way I was able to keep up with the sprayer. So here, the sprayer has a 90 foot boom, and he's added nozzles so that they, he can get 50 gallons per acre spray rate so that he can apply the biology without hurting it or as, with as little harm as possible. This is a hay field, it's a 53 acre field where he was spraying 30 gallons an acre on this field and I was able to keep up making extract while he was spraying. I was able to keep up with a round trip, it took him about an hour and 45 minutes and I was making about 700 gallons of extract an hour.